The second person has died from their wounds after a shooting outside of a banquet hall in Orange County. The sheriff's office says Jonathan Frazier died yesterday. He was one of four people who was shot over the weekend. West Tucson tonight, Gabrigatigas explains we're learning that he was a beloved pastor in the community. Jonathan Frazier is now the second person to die from this Orange County shooting. He was one of four people who were hit outside of Unity Banquet Hall. He was my brother. He was my brother in Christ. Orlando Pastor Stovalio Stovall shared a close friendship with Frazier for over 20 years. He says Frazier was also a pastor. It just sad and it just it pierced my heart to lose an awesome man of God at this gun violence that's taking over our city. The sheriff's office says two of the victims from the shooting have since left the hospital. More than 100 people were at the banquet hall for an event. Investigators say a dispute led to gunshots fired outside just after midnight on Saturday morning. Willie Bell Jr. died later that day. It's disturbing when you have that many people and no one's come forward yet. One of the investigators says they cannot solve the case alone. Without the story being told by the people that were there, that were present, it's hard for us to piece together what exactly happened. Deputies say Frazier was closing down the banquet hall when he was shot. He was in critical condition until he died Monday. His heart was so big. He never had nothing negative to say about nobody. Stovall says Frazier would deliver sermons next door to the banquet hall. He was a father, husband, and recently welcomed a new grandchild. He especially loved serving his community. My brother would help anybody, anybody. And he wanted to make a difference to help our young people live different, um, to save as many souls as we can possible. Uh, and to help the city of Orlando. In Orange County, Seneca Brigadigas, Wash 2 News. A $5,000 reward is being offered for any information. If you know anything, please call Crime Line at 423-TIPS.